Hello, I am Rebecca, an AI creation. In this AI-driven era, it is crucial to incorporate lifelike animated characters in roles like news anchoring, video presentations, or even commercials. So today's topic is on crafting adaptable, multilingual animated characters for seamless integration into any scenario. So, let's get started. In this tutorial, I will be using Leonardo AI for image generation, as it is free. So, here's how to get started. First, open Leonardo AI and click on Start using Leonardo. Then, choose the option I'm whitelisted and log in using your Google account. Once you are in, start by selecting a fine tuned model, for instance, I will choose Absolute Reality. Now, experiment with different prompts to discover the perfect appearance for your character. Once you have found the ideal look, upscale the image and save it to your computer. This will serve as the foundation for creating your characters. For a complete tutorial on Leonardo AI, check the link in the description. To generate various versions of your avatar, you need to fixate the name of your character while making slight adjustments to the prompts. So, let's name our character, Rebecca. This approach enables you to experiment with diverse appearances and styles for your character. For instance, if you want your character to be a news anchor, just type news anchor. Alternatively, you can also specify what your character is wearing. Once you've chosen your preferred variations, be sure to upscale and save them accordingly. If you want to learn more on character consistency, check my video link in the description. Now, go ahead and visit remove.bg and upload an image that you previously made using Leonardo AI. Once the image is uploaded, the background will be removed. However, we want to replace the background with a green one. So, click on the Edit option. Next, navigate to the Color tab, and from the palette, choose the color green. Don't forget to click OK to confirm your selection. Once you're done with this step, click here to download the edited image. Repeat these steps for all the images you have generated. Now, let's shift our focus to audio. To create natural sounding AI voices, follow these steps. Start by opening 11 labs and simply input the text you want to turn into lifelike speech. Next, choose a voice that suits the personality of your character from the drop down menu. In just a matter of seconds, your audio will be generated. Hello, I am Rebecca, an AI creation. In this AI driven era, you also have the option to select your preferred language before generating the audio. Finally, click on this button to download your audio file. It's important to note that if you don't sign in, you will be limited to working with about 300 characters. However, once you log in, you'll have the advantage of having a generous 10,000 characters available to you for free. To animate your characters, head over to studio.did.com, click on guest. Then click login and use your Google account to login. You will get 20 credits for free. To start, click on create video and you will find a range of pre-existing avatars to choose from. But in this case, we will upload our own character we created in Leonardo AI with green background. For the audio part, you can create text to audio by typing in your script. However, since we already have our audio from 11 labs, we will simply upload it here. Now, click on the Generate Video button, and then again click Generate. Within a matter of seconds, your video will be ready. Hello, I am Rebecca, an AI creation. In this AI-driven era, Now, in the final step, open up your preferred video editing software, then import the avatar video you have generated. Next, insert a background image or video of your choice, and after aligning the video, eliminate the green screen effect. After that, go ahead and render the video, and once it's ready, simply download it. Lifelike animated characters, in roles like, news anchor. If you found this video informative, then don't forget to hit the like button, share it with your friends, give your feedback in the comments, and maybe even subscribe.